Hey, I'm Ryan Naylor, and this is how to play Stay, I Missed You by Lisa Loeb and Nine Stories. This is a massive tune, It or at least it was back in the 90s, 94 this came out. Uh, very fond memories of this song, and I just randomly stumbled upon the intro with a student, Delphine, uh, during one of her lessons, and we went and checked it out, and I transcribed it, and I uh, couldn't help myself, so I wanted to bring it to you today. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already part of the family and give me a big fat thumbs up if you enjoy the video. It really helps me out. A lovely, a lovely little introduction to this piece. We're going to be capoed on the sixth fret. And our first chord is going to be this. That's called a G sus2. All right. And how I'm going to do it with fingers one and three. Sometimes you might see one and four, the one and three. And we, how we pick that, it's a slow tempo, 80 BPM. We go one E and two, three, four. So it's one E and. Now I forgot to mention before, all fret numbers will be relative to the capo. So I'm right up at the top of the neck, but all the frets as if the capo is the nut. So then at the next, chord is an E minus 7. So I'm using fingers 1, 3 and 4 for that grip. And we pick through that in 16th notes. It's 1, E and a 2. When she plays this, she's getting her fingers kind of a, I think she's a bit of a hybrid mix of pick and fingers. I prefer to have my pick throughout all of this, okay? So that together goes 1, E and 2, 3, 4, 1, E and a 2, 3, 4, Okay, and then we go into these lovely kind of these kind of two two note rather three notes, two fingers on the board. I'm using finger two on the sixth string and finger three on the second string. And we're starting in the fifth fret. We pick the sixth string and then the open G and then the fifth fret of the B string. And then we go back to the bass note. And then we slide up into the seventh fret, seven, seven, both fingers. The same picking pattern again. So that's one and two and three and four and and then we slide into the eighth fret and we a little sixteenth note figure one and a two and that's yes, one and a two and I've got my pinky finger up in the tenth fret, creating what is a C sus two chord. One and a two and three and four and I've added in there a little hit back on the bass note of the end of after beat number three, which she does when she plays this live. It's go one and a two and three and four, just like that. So putting that all together, this is the intro and it's the first part of. I'm not quite sure what this is. When the vocal starts, I'm not sure how to name the sections in this song, but all that together goes like this: one and two. So that's a 12 second when you say only hear what I want to. And then again at 24 seconds, you say I talk so all the time, so. And then we hit into what I'm guessing, calling the verse at 36 seconds and we start some strumming. And the two chords that we've got here, we've got this one, not quite there. Bottom four strings, it's five, three, five, five. That makes what is an A minus seven. You might not have seen this grip before. One way to play an A minus seven chord. And then we're going to the G chord, a G bar in the third fret, E shaped bar chord. Top two strings, maybe don't hear it quite so much. We're focusing the strum on the lower strings, but if we hit those high ones, it's okay. But don't hit the highs on the A minus seven. And the rhythm I've got here is gonna be a 16th note rhythm. If you're not familiar with 16th, check out my lesson. I did it a little while ago to get your 16th note strumming up to speed. And this strumming pattern I've kept throughout. It sometimes changes up as she plays it live, but I'm sticking to this one pattern. And uh, it's gonna go like this. One, a, two, E, and One, a, and E, and four, and a one, a, and E, and four, and a down. Look 
out the key thing really is that syncopation and that G chord hits on the end, the upbeat of two. One, a two, and. If you can't get a 60th note strum, then just do that. One, two, and, E, M, O, and a one, two, and. So getting that syncopation. So that bit with, with the vocal goes like this. And I thought what I felt was simple. And I thought that I don't belong. And now that I am leaving, know that I did something wrong, cause I missed you. 48 seconds, we hit what is a C sus 2. Alright. Bit of work for finger number one here. After the third fret of the A string. And the rhythm I've kept as it was before. One, up, down, up, down, 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 up. We go to a C minor, adding on finger two at the fourth fret of the B string. So it goes. Minor. And you're back to the A minor 7G of 54 seconds. Miss you. At one minute we're back to the intro part, and it goes... You say, I only hear what I want to, and then it goes a little different. We're using those same chord shapes again, but this time we're kind of strumming it, doing a one and two. Going a down, so it's pick, pick, strum, down, up. pick. That's the pattern in each of those three chords. Again, I've kind of simplified this a bit from her live performances. And then at the end of that, we have a G chord, keeping that rhythm the same. So this bit goes, I don't listen hard, don't pay attention to the distance that you're running to anyone, anywhere. Don't understand if you really care. And then you end on the C sus too. an extra measure and 120 kind of back into the verse turn the radio on I turn the radio up and this woman was singing my song so you do that eight measures a total of eight times so at 144 we get kind of a bridge part where we're hitting up an A minor chord a bit tricky for me on this guitar without a cutaway but it's in the fifth fret of the A of the E string sorry and I thought I'd live forever but now I'm not so sure you try and tell me C sus 2 for a measure, all down 8th notes Tell me that I'm clever, but that won't take me anyhow And then we pick again these these two notes kind of Anywhere with you And ending on that C, that C sus 2 again So that part together goes like this and I thought I'd live forever But now I'm not so sure you're trying to tell me that I'm clever But that won't take me anyhow Anywhere with you And then 156 kind of back into the verse chords again So it goes You said that I was naive And I thought that I was strong I thought hey I can leave, I can leave Oh but now I know that I was wrong Cause that's Jesus like before, yeah, I miss you. And again, 220, that kind of um, bridge part. You said you call me cause you want me, and when do you let me go? You're trying to keep away a keeper, but keep me cause you know you're just so scared to do. And you say 232 into the outro, like the intro again. So there it is. You can get tubs from my website. Thank you, Lisa Loeb. That is a great tune. If you did like the tutorial, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe for more like this, and I'll see you again very soon. Bye-bye!